Hey guys, welcome back to the Pokey Shed. And today we got a Hidden Fates and a Shining Fates Elite Trainer box to open. So we're gonna crack both of them, see if we can hit a Charizard or any full out Shinies, and um, see how we do. Now, anyone follow along lately, my luck has been pretty bad lately. Uh, I opened a lot of Chilling Rain pre, or the Build and Battle kits. I didn't uh, videotape them, but I hit two out of I think like 30 something packs so it was pretty bad so hopefully this turns it around today uh, so I have the Hidden Fate set complete so I don't really need anything from there just like the full Charizard or one of the evolutions uh, but I still am missing about half the Shining Fates baby Shinies and some of the full art so hopefully we can hit some of the ones we don't have there So I'm just going to crack these two open and let's see what we get. So obviously Hidden Face was the first set to come out with um, the Shiny Volt. And the big hitter in there is the Charizard GX. Five $600 card now, rah. And then in Shining Fates, which came out in February, got them by. We have... Um, Charge their V Max Shiny in that one. And that's, uh, I think, a $250 card right now. So, lots to pull. Uh, I also got like the Lapras V Max, the Diddle V Max. Two gold cards. So, lots to pull in there. So, that's our 10 packs. Not going to worry about too much about anything else inside. Uh, here's a promo card. So, that's the EV V Max in Shining Fates. And we get the. Birds GX in Hidden Fates and everything else can just go away. Alright, so we'll go side for side for this. Back and forth. So we got Hidden Fates and we got Shining Fates. Alright, let's start with Hidden Fates. Alright. Four from the back. And the Shining is in the Reverse Hollow slot. And then there's also the main set, which will have... Um, the main set in Shining Fates is better than the main set in Hidden Fates. Not really Misty's Gym and Jesse James. So Jesse and James Full Air is probably one of the best uh, cards in Hidden Fates main set. So the Shining Vault is definitely what you want in Hidden Fates. Whereas in Shining Fates... Uh, some of the full art trainers are, are pretty good cards to pull. Uh, so typically you get about four or five hits per ETB in these. So we should be looking at about 10 hits at, or eight to 10 hits today. All right, let's pick this up a little bit. Rowlet, Trappage, Weasel, Copping, Shinx, Energy, Floatzel, Luxio, Rustic Sword, Nicket, and Volcanion. So 0 for 2. Like I said, usually in ETB, you, with Hidden Fates, I mean, you usually 4 and 2 get a, at least one full art Shawnee or Hyper Rare. So let's see what we can get in this one. Clefairy, Magikarp, Energy, Sabrina, Scyther, Charmeleon. So we got a Garchomp. And the Jolteon. So there's our first shiny hit. Is this Garchomp. So like I said, I have all the subset for... Or I have all the set for Shining Fates. Or Hidden Fates. So I don't need that one. Kind of just looking for the full arts in that one. But with Shining Fates, definitely need some more baby shinies in there. Two, three, four, and two. So we got a Yanma, more Pekko, Eevee, Basketball, Snom, Energy, Sword, Elegloss, Star Treks. So we got a Yan Mask and a Dredna. So I think I do need the Yan Mask for that set. So that's a good pull there. So another baby shiny. So you can see how they kind of compare different sets, but they're both. Shiny Vault, 
uh, when they did Hidden Fates. They reprinted a lot of these artworks just as Shawnee's. And Shawnee Fates are their own card. Alright, third pack here. Four and two. Clefairy, Jiggly, Caterpie, Eevee, Ekans. So Hidden Fate subset really focus on the original 150 Pokemon as well. So we have Misty and a Raichu GX. So nothing spectacular there. Only about probably a two dollar card. Alright. So I said the set, the uh, Shining Fates main set is better because you have those different full art trainer cards. Skyla's in there. I think it's like a thirty dollar card. But now the Shining set is much better in Weasel. And yeah, Mega and Hidden Fates. Got a lot of the original 150 and Shines. You got Charizard. You got the some Evolutions. You got Mewtwo. You got I'm trying to think now some other ones that are in there. You got the four Gold Tapus, which are good as well. Voltorb, Pikachu, Jiggly, Energy, Misty, Metapod, Charmeleon. That's a nice pull there. That's a nice Sylveon. That centering looks really good too. And a Butterfree. So that's a nice pull. It's probably the second best, well third best because the Umbreon's a habit. Third best pull you can get. Lovely front centering. Oh, is that a chip or is that on the sleeve? Oh, it's on the sleeve. Okay, perfect. Nice. Now the back centering is slightly off. But that's a pretty good pull. I think it's about a hundred dollar card. Set your money back on your ETB right there. Great pull. Actually, let's showcase that in the back. And let's move on to another Shining Fates pack. So yeah, like those are the ones you want to get, those Evolutions, Umbreon and Sylveon and Espeon are the big three, Leafeon and Glaceon, still pretty good, but don't stack up to the other three. More Petko, Cacnea, Horsey, Q-Font, Choodle, Energy, Thwacky, Cramorant, Rotom, Brillaboombi. I'm after pulling Rillaboom V, I'd say, 10 times. And in DD. Like, it's getting pretty, it's getting to the point where, like, it's only like a $5 card. But I'm after pulling Rillaboom V so many times and haven't pulled the VMAX yet. It's starting to get a bit frustrating. I hate, like, between Rillaboom V and in DD V and Shining Fates. That seems like that's the only thing I pull. So it's getting very frustrating. And more than likely, there's not another full art shiny in there. So, kind of sucks, but we'll see. Sometimes you get lucky. Charmander, Fairy, Psyduck, Energy, Surge, Center, Sabrina. We got Psychic Energy and a Blaine. All right, so I think this is the halfway point here. Let's see if we can hit another shiny out of Shining Fates. Full art trainer would be nice. I think I'm still missing one of those for my full art binder as well. <clears throat> Coughing, Shinx, Grookey, Crapinch, Yanma, Energy, Dartrex, Elgas, Luxio, Luxio, and Rillaboom. So another Rillaboom. All right, Hidden Fates again. So still, you still get the baby shinies in this. You. The ones you want to get are like the Charmander, Charmeleon, Eevee. Those three babies are the best in Hidden Fates. And then the Suicune is the good one in uh, Shining Fates. Haven't pulled that one yet. Clefairy, Jiggly, Caterpie, Paris, Psyduck, Energy, Jinx, Graveler, Farfetch'd, Voltorb, and Bill. So not a whole lot there. Alright, 
one, two, three, four, and two. All right, we got Nickit, Grookey, Yamma, Morpeko, Chudo, Energy, Shield, Dietrex, Elegas, Morpeko, and Manaphy. Got some Doug packs going here. What well, we got? Four left each. Right, here we go. Two, three, four, and two. Magikarp, Geodude, Clefairy, Eevee, Ekans, Energy, Brock, Koga, Misty. So we got the Gabite and an Eevee. So we got the Garchamp, or Garchomp, and the Gabite. So all we're missing is the Gibble. Hey, right, here we go, Shining Fate. See if we can get something exciting here. The last few ETBs of Shining Fates I opened have not been exciting whatsoever. And two. All right, we got more Peko, Nickit, TV, Gaspar, Chudo, Energy, Luxio, Rusted Sword, Ball Guy. We got a Corviknight, which I already have. So out of like over half of the baby shines, I don't have a pool one I have. And Celebi. Which kind of blows, but again, that's all you can do when you're opening packs. All right, three hidden fates left. Can we get lucky and get a second full art? It happens sometimes. Sometimes you'll pull a, a gold card with one of the full arts. Three, four, and two. So let's see if we can get lucky here. We already got four and a half hits out of hidden fates, so that might be it. Got a bill. And a Snorlax. Three, four, and two. All right. Centering on that back one is pretty bad. So we got Snom, Grookey, Eevee, Morpeko, Chudo, Energy, Trainer, Thwacky, Cremorant, Got the Dene, which I also think I have. And a Greedent. So we got a double hit there. But again, nothing nothing that's really good. And that back centering. Let's check out that back centering on that one. Not really off. But I think I already have the Greedent. Or Greedent. So what's that? One, two, just five there. And four and a half for Hidden Fate. So we might be... Pretty much out of luck here now with the last few packs, but we'll see. Definitely love to pull another full art, but like I said, this is usually pretty rare. Charmander, Voltorb, Coughing, Ekans, Cubone, Energy, Chansey, Graveler, Giovanni. We got a Dark Energy. Oh, we got a full art Jesse and James, which is pretty good. It's like a $15 card. It's pretty nice. And we got the energy. So what's that? One, two, three, four, five. Five hits and two hollow energies. Pretty good ETB. Two. Can we get anything else that is Shining Fates? Coughing, Morpeko, Horsey, Spinark, Rowlet, Energy, Trainer, Towel, Floatzel, Trainer, and a Frost Math. So nothing in that one. All right, last pack of Hidden Fates. I'm expecting a dud because we've already hit five hits and two hollow energies, but you never know. Pika, Voltorb, Coughing, Cubone, Geodude, we got Energy, Sabrina, Pokemon Center, we have Metapod, Stereo, and Kangaskhan. Alright, last pack here from Shining Fate. Have hit five hits, which is about the, the average for Shining Fate's ETB. Uh, I have seen up as far as eight, so I'm not saying we're not going to get anything, but I won't be surprised if we don't. Snom, Horsey, Rowlet, Morpeko, Spinak, 
Energy, Tropius, Cameron, Rusted, Star Trek's, and Boss's Orders. So, nothing there. So, the best two hits of the day were these two. Sylveon being the best by far. It's a $100 card. And then you got your Jesse and James. I think it's about a $15 card. And then not much out of the Shining Fates. Rillaboom was the big hit, but again, it's only like a $5 card. So, pretty much lost out on the Shining Fates there. That's the gamble you take when you open packs. So guys, thanks for checking it out. Um, stay tuned. We should have some chilling rain rips going on in the next little while. Hopefully getting that in soon. I uh, was supposed to have some Eevee heroes too, but haven't heard back from them. So it doesn't look like we'll be getting them anytime soon. Till next time. Enjoy.